Good morning to you. Here you join me just as we meet in a van on Daffodil Road. Just look at them. They're marvellous, aren't they? And what a glorious day here. Yeah. I mean, it's just incredible, isn't it? I suggest um, if you're at work, you get some holidays or throw a sicky. I could never suggest you throw a sicky, of course. I'm only joking. But ha. Oh, We've got about three days this week that are going to be absolutely marvellous. Still a bit nippy, yeah, so... Oh, anyway, yeah, uh, it's Monday, I'm beginning of the week, but it's a short week, and oh, oh the weather's just turned right, hasn't it? Um, it's just marvellous. But anyway, I'm going to crack on with some photos, I've got a lot to get through, and... Um, Ian Mack, yeah, he's been out first time this year because he's uh, uh, had um, had a lurgy, yeah, a winter lurgy, and he's he's out on uh, Black Beauty, yeah, um, marvellous Triumph Tiger, excellent, and at the Pegnum Watermill uh, uh, windmill. Well, that's just marvellous, isn't it? I've got I've got a phone ringing in my pocket. That's annoying. Um, uh, also, staying in Suffolk, GS. Yeah, he sent us a picture of the Suffolk giraffe. Yeah, there you go. Look at that. Uh, and his um, Hornet 900 uh, that he had once, because we were on about Hornets when he sent that picture. Um, if I've already shown this picture, well, I'm sorry, but there you go. Uh, and uh, but a, another giraffe, they're everywhere. Um, also, got uh, an email from uh, HS uh, talking on Naughty Boys. Yeah, sent us a picture of his CBR 650R that he had. Yeah, excellent. When they ruled the world. Yeah. Uh, what else did we get? Nigel um, of uh, Northern Optics. Yeah, he sent us a picture from 2018, I think it was, of uh, Honda Goldwing, mate. I mean, just look at these. Ha! <laughs> Never before has there been so much weight in one place. I hope they strengthened the car park for it. Marvellous, marvellous bikes, of course in the right place um, not my cup of tea but definitely my brother's cup of tea yeah marvellous uh, what else do we get oh IT he messaged he said I can't go out this weekend I've been out every weekend forever yeah um, so he's got to stay home and do some chores guess what he didn't no he went out on his bike yeah marvellous so there you go uh, TRK, yeah, he couldn't resist him, he just had to get out. Um, I know the feeling, Ian, yeah, um, but there you go. Also, I'll tell you what I did like, um, uh, Lillian, yeah, from Sweden, Lillian and Robert, they, they posted a picture on Instagram uh, and sent it to us as well. Uh, they're two black dogs uh, watching tape or not watching Tim, they turned around to have their photo taken but I think they were probably taken by the uh, CMX 1100 and it all been black yeah, marvellous picture um, I do like to see dogs, you know that um, what else did we get? oh, ah uh, ah, uh, yeah uh, after his accident he's uh, got his Triumph Trident and he's been out, went for a uh, country pub lunch yeah, marvellous picture. Um, oh, then, then where did we get? Uh, oh, so many. Sorry, my eyes are watering a little bit. Sorry about that. Uh, my, my eyes were watering, and with the cold, my glasses were steaming up. Yeah, marvellous. Um, oh, what, uh, I forgot where we were. Oh, ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah. Um, 
HS also sent me an email. Do you remember I said, has anyone ever heard back from a manufacturer, you know, running about how long it takes them to get back? Well, he said, yeah. He said he wrote to India, to Roy Lenfield once, about his clock on his 535, which only had kilometres on. So he wrote to them and just said, this isn't fit for purpose. Um, and they did come back to him and they said, yeah, go to your local dealer, show them this. Uh, we'll send you a new clock, we'll, we'll send you one with uh, miles per hour on. So that was marvellous. Um, I had a few emails about that, about people saying, well, uh, I wrote to so-and-so and so-and-so. Um, a lot of people, as kids, wrote about trying to get free stuff and never did, so... Um, uh, anyway, uh, also, while we're on that sort of subject, Aussie Biker Dude, who's got a video out, I'll put a link there, yeah, marvellous, tour of Brisbane, um, but uh, he also sent uh, um, an email, oh well, actually, if you look on his on one of his videos, he's actually drawn uh, an all year motorcyclist sticker on his on his thing because they have obviously I haven't got any stickers I am trying to get some made um, and he wrote and said just in case because I said to him send me your address and I'll get a sticker to you well he's going to be the first person to get a sticker I'm still waiting I'm still trying to sort out a decent source for them and when I do uh, maybe we'll give one away a mutter or something like that I don't know but uh, Aussie Bike Dude's going to be the first Anyway, back to photos, and um, TP sent us a picture, oh, this is incredible, of Gertrude. First time out, yeah, marvellous, uh, uh, this year, uh, classic 500, Bertie's sister. That's oh, just marvellous, isn't it? Yeah, incredible. Um, also, my mate Ian Hughes, he sent us a picture of his, because uh, we'd been talking about it, uh, Yamaha Tracer 900. So he said he, he bought it, biggest mistake he'd made, only had it a couple of months, got rid of it. Um, and I always say that there are no bad bikes, which is true, um, to a point. Um, and the only bike I, ha I haven't liked, and it's just me, personal preference, and that's what Ian says about his. Uh, couldn't get on with it, didn't like it. No, um, I think mine was slightly different to that one here. Mine was the GT9 or something like that. I can't remember, but very similar. Couldn't get on with it at all. Uh, magnificent engine, magnificent handling. Um, just a, a weird bike for me. But there you go. Um, I want to have a mutter. Um, but I'll, I'll save that to the end let's quickly go through a few videos because old school motorcycles Phil is finally back at home because I mean, he goes all over the place doing his job his electrical work and stuff um, he's collected his gold star he's been out and he's finally got a little video on he's still playing with it a little bit but marvellous, get over and have a look uh, Mercy Moto as well uh, oh, went out on the scrap Oh, all sorts of shenanigans, all sorts of things. Very interesting video. I'll not spoil it for you. Get over, have a look. New biker, twisties. Went out on the twisties uh, on that Kawasaki, um, which is absolutely marvellous, which also brings me on to Solo Motor UK and Derek getting his new bike. I'm sure you all know now. BMW GS850, oh, whatever it is, special thing. Um, gets that Wednesday, hope to see him on Thursday, Stun and Barnes, bike night, be there, be square, you've been told, don't say you haven't, yeah, marvellous, uh, Stun and Barnes, back on the, uh, on the calendar from this Thursday, hope the weather stays fine, it's forecast to be a cracking day, so it should be a cracking night, um, oh, I forgot where I was now, uh, oh, saddlebags as well. He's revealed his plans. He's got social ride. I did his going. Loads of people are going. Everyone's going to be there. So another mate, if you're down in the southwest, uh, B 
be there or be square be a saddlebag social ride yeah marvellous um, Exeter rider no doubt he'll be there uh, uh, Exeter rider um, hope everything's working out hope things you know it's a bad time for you I know that um, uh, you're a trooper and uh, we'll catch up at some point yeah marvellous um, he's got a video out as well as uh, Exeter Rider uh, on um, just some cuts he's put together he's very busy in his life at the moment um, what else have we got Aussie Biker Dude I told you about that didn't I told you about Aussie Biker Dude uh, goes uh, for a ride on his Meteor 350 uh, through Brisbane and it's like having a little personal tour of Brisbane it's marvellous uh, and there is one interesting point very early on in the video um, a wrecked out old car just as he's going past the uh, uh, 4X beer is it Castle Main 4X? I think so, I, I don't know um, anyway, get over and have a look at that uh, and obviously my mate Ian Hughes has got a video um, and of course I've been watching economical rides marvellous videos uh, oh uh, there's so many more I'm not going to have time because um, what do I want to have a much about uh, obviously as I've already said Stun and Barnes bike night this Thursday uh, from about 5.30 I think uh, don't know what time I'll get there um, hope to be going with uh, uh, maybe TC Banana Man I don't know if they'll be going hopefully they will and hopefully uh, uh, the whole gang will be there yeah um, and then what I wanted to get onto right yeah as you know last year uh a lot of you sent me some videos of you dancing in front of your bike and some without your bike some with your helmet on some without your helmet on um, but you've got one last chance to send me a little clip only needs to be like 15 seconds it's all I need of you dancing to oh, uh, Elvis Presley something like that um, I think I found a way now of doing the video and if I haven't morning giraffe I'm just I'm busy yeah okay sorry um, he didn't have out to say anyway um, yeah if you send me a little video uh, if I can if if what I've got planned doesn't work because the things have changed on YouTube um, and uh, obviously I've started Instagram as well so there's a multitude of platforms I can do it on but also one of my other problems was actually getting one of the charities to message me back I know it's ridiculous you'd think when you're trying to raise money for them it would be fairly easy it's not so what I thought um, the distinguished gentleman's ride is for mental health and for uh, prostate well as you know uh, prostate cancer is uh, very important uh, my dad died of it um, uh, my best mate has, uh, has got it at the moment um, but yeah it's terrible anyway so any money raised I will leave a link so what I'm going to do is I'm going to register for uh, the gentleman's ride distinguished gentleman's ride um, and link it to that and I'll hopefully put a link on for, for that in, in the description of the video when it comes out so that if you choose to um, you could make a donation through that so hopefully that'll work out um, yeah I, I, I do want to thank everyone who's already sent a video in um, I do have enough but I could always do with some more and shorten out because I've, I've split a few people up what I've done is I've split it up so you get them repeated a few times but they're doing different moves and boy what some moves I mean it really turned uh, Mrs Tim's head but anyway it's Monday oh, short week will there be a Friday mutter or a Thursday mutter 
not sure yet not sure but anyway take care it's going to fly by and get out in the evening ta-ta